Since movie making began and on through the 1980s, science fiction motion pictures and TV series have used what was then state of the art technology to create fantastic new worlds, starships, and space battles. The process required motion control cameras, intricate models, and thousands of hours to create sequences that lasted only a few moments on the screen. For their time, they were revolutionary. Now, a new special effects revolution is brewing, and Babylon 5 is the first series to take advantage of that revolution, producing amazing outer space scenes without models, without strings, and believe it or not, without cameras. Because all the visual effects for Babylon 5 are entirely computer generated, there are no physical models. You can move all around them. They don't have to be mounted like a model does. These are shots that you just could not do with models and cameras. Not, not that it would be expensive to do, you just couldn't do it. One of the things that we've really tried to do is lose the computery feel. Talented animators stretch the limits of a new state of the art, which changes and improves daily. Shoot. The actress, or actor, in this case the actress, in the cockpit mock-up on, on the stage. And then we'll bring it in, and we composite it into our computer-generated chip. Standby Alpha Wing, ready to launch. Even effects like laser blasts and matted in backgrounds are now done with computer art. I think that the results are a little better because it is a much easier way to, to animate um, and to see the flow of action. We're going to set the standard in a lot of this for a lot of other shows, because I don't think anyone else is working in 2D this way, and I don't think anyone's really doing 3D the way we're doing it here. What's giving you production value are the people that are operating those machines. We're investing in the artist, not the equipment. Most space battles look like a TV game. The thing that makes the type of computer-generated imagery that we're doing different is we're using filmmakers to do it. We're all designers, we're all artists. This is Commander Jeffrey Sinclair of Babylon 5 to raiding party. Surrender your vessels or be destroyed. We really wanted to create a more colorful looking universe. Gotcha. That sense of rich multi-layered textures extends to every aspect of Babylon 5's production.